Hello today I'm going to teach you how to crochet a simple grand square. Just get your yarn and the recommended hook size for that yarn. Begin with a slip knot and a chain of four. After you chain four, go into your first chain that you chained and slip stitch to it, making a ring for your stitches to go into. Then you're going to chain three and going back into the ring you are going to make two double crochets. off your square and then going back into the ring you are going to make three more double crochets and you're going to repeat that two more times after this time so you're going to chain two make three uh, double crochets and then chain two and make three more double crochets you're going to chain two and then you are going to slip stitch to the top of your chain three. All right, that is what it looks like after round one. You're going to chain three and then turn your work. So we're going to begin in the chain space from the last round, the chain 2 space. So you're going to put two double crochets in there, chain 2, then another two double crochets. Alright, so after you finish there, you're going to chain 1 to get to your next corner space. And in that next chain space, you're going to do three double crochets, chain two, and another three double crochets. At the end of that, you're going to chain one and go to the next corner space and do the same thing over again till you get to the end of your row. Alright, so I've reached the end of my round. Now I'm going to chain one and slip stitch to the top of my chain three. And then I'm going to chain three and turn my work again. So this row is a little bit different. You're going to see a chain space right below your work. So instead of doing the corner stitch, we're just going to double crochet two into that, chain one and work and move over to our corner stitch, which is where we're going to do our three double crochets, chain three, three double crochets. So in the smaller spaces in between the corners, you're just going to do three double crochets. And to transfer to the corners, you're just going to chain one to get to those corners. But to make your granny square bigger, you're just going to keep continuing the same pattern over and over again until it's as big as you want. I hope you had fun crocheting, and I'll see you next time.